What's up guys, it's your girl Anna, so I'm sure you've heard by now that there will be no new games from NetherRealm Studios next year. So no announcements at all this year. WB Games was scheduled to announce a few games at E3, but Rocksteady Studios and NetherRealm actually backed out of it and decided not to announce anything for whatever reason. Rocksteady already tweeted out an apology, which Ed Boon retweeted, since many of us were expecting the new Superman game. And yeah, it's a real bummer that nothing has been announced at this E3, but that doesn't mean that it will never come. NetherRealm Studios typically has a two-year pattern for new games, and Ed Boon himself already said at an earlier interview that if we follow the pattern, we should be able to figure things out. Well, we followed the pattern, Ed. What happened? It is kind of refreshing to uh, have a change of pattern, and I think it's safe to say that any of us would choose quality over quantity. And I know that's not just me, I'm sure we all feel that way, well, most of us. Ed Boon had an interview at E3 where he talks about the situation and gives us some kind of idea as to what's going on. Uh, Ed, no game, what's going on? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this is... Uh, I. Uh, well, we, we've had E3s where there's no game. You're right. Um, uh, before, in the yeah, past. Definitely. Um, um, there's, 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 there's definitely like a pattern we've been following that we've uh -huh. kind of broken out of. Um, and I'm, I'm surprised how many people know about that pattern. You know, <laughs> I, I, I didn't think that many people were taking, you know, writing it down, but, but it's, certainly, it's certainly something that we're, we're changing around. And I wish I could, uh, you know, comp against the bit to talk about stuff but but at the moment we have nothing that we're announcing is that is that, is that <laughs> <laughs> so that's that no reveals for now in my opinion i would say that we can safely expect something for 2020 possibly on the next gen console since there will probably be a ps5 by then uh, which also means that the next mk game will be badass as fuke okay so please have patience and let's get hype until then although i already made a video predicting mk11 being cancelled <laughs> based on what ed boon said on twitter deconfirming it on twitter you can still expect me to make my first roster predictions and dlc predictions for the next MK game, so look forward to that. I will also be streaming MKX more often as well as Injustice 2 here and there, and will upload the King of the Hill matches on YouTube so you can get an idea of my playstyle and stuff since I did used to compete. I will put the link for my Twitch channel in the description below. Make sure you go and follow it to catch me live, and uh, maybe y'all can join me in the matches. And I know that I said I would eat my hair if MK11 wasn't announced at E3, since we were all so sure that they would. So here goes nothing. If you liked the video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, share it with others, and subscribe!